call. We gotta sing hallelujah showers and thank you for joining me at Open Your Bible. Singing the song of Moses and the Lamb, 
that's what I want, you know. I, I want to stop playing these electronic things and using these things. I mean, you know, I want my heart where I can play in the town again. And, I, like, um, and, and um, it's not like when you die, that you're going to turn an angel and go up to heaven and have a heart, nothing like that, right? You want your heart, okay, you want it, and you want it in life. And Jesus has promised us these things. So, um, you know, you maybe can't play music now, but in you know, that time it won't be anything. You know, so many things you'll be able to do, right? It can be an angel of God. So, yeah, I'm telling you, right? I want my heart, I want to be there. Okay, I want to see my Jesus. I want to be able to hug him. I want to be, I want to be there, right? And so I want to get out of this virtual um, thing, this thing of, you know, imagination and get into the reality of it, the real thing. Now we see through a glass darkly, but then we'll be face to face. My God, hallelujah. The message last year, don't settle. Don't settle. And the message today, keep your eyes focused on Jerusalem and what is happening there. Be careful of fear. Fear takes you over, can cause you to be telling lies. And from those lies will come destruction. Be careful. Fear begins to come upon you. Trust in God. Ask Him to make a way for you. Ask Him to show you what to do. And if you don't know what to do, just ask Him to do it for you. He's a mighty God. He will do it. He has done it before. He will do it again. Now let us live.
around the library too. How we meet again, can we meet at Jesus' feet? my birthday and um, thank God, I want to thank God for keeping me out of here. My pilgrimage has been, has been beset by many, many things. God is faithful. So I said, your grace has brought me, saved us far. Your grace will lead me on. I believe that truly I'm persuaded that he's able to Keep that job coming in and give me a day. Can I give God thanks for my birthday? Yeah, even right now. So I wore something. I like what my dad I said to me. So next week, I guess I'll talk about my birthday again, but then it will be like six days gone. Here in this life, by the grace of God, how sweet it would be if we could start next year into eternity.